YouTube, what's going on? Bowman1951, back at you with the first video of 2019. I'm really excited to welcome you to the new recording studio. We've got a brand new backdrop. I've got studio lighting as well as a microphone now to help with some sound while I record. I don't know how long I'm going to stay with this setup because I'd like to stay at the sorting table where I've got a little more room to show off things. Uh, but for now, we've got this uh, set up in another area of the man cave. Featured in today's video is also going to be our first break of 2019. So we've got Topps Gallery. This was a Walmart exclusive from 2018. And I'm just going to show off some of the odds here quickly. Um, we're guaranteed two autographs out of this box. Some of the parallels seem slightly easy to hit compared to other products. But uh, basically we're looking for uh, the two autos that are in uh, this box here. And while I go ahead and start getting this open just wanted to do the first self-promotion of my two social media platforms got Bowman cards 1951 on Instagram I've actually got uh, over 100 followers there already and uh, we got Bowman 1951 on Twitter hope to be using both a lot more in the future showing off some random cards I get here and there as well as uh, you know just uh, sharing some of the videos uh, cross promotion platforms if you will Okay, we're gonna get the box unloaded here. We've got the box loader. Probably open that first. And here are the packs. So I'm a little late to the party on this Topps Gallery product, but I've seen many of you open a box previously and was really excited to see what some of you had gotten. So. Decided to ask for it for Christmas. My wonderful auntie got me a box and here we are finally opening it on camera. So the top loader is a nice Randy Johnson here. Randy Johnson Masters. Guess we can put that out front. All right, let's get into pack number one. We've got a bunch out here that we need to uh, unload. In the background today, on the left, we've got a Mike Trout, 2018 Topps Heritage, New Age Performers, Jim Mint 10 that I had pack pulled. And on the right is my autographed Dustin Pedroia rookie from uh, Thunder Elite. Okay, first pack, got the Rice Hoskins rookie card. Salvador Perez. Dylan Cousins, Walker Bueller. Not sure, is this some kind of parallel? I think this is just uh, a different artist, I believe. The 52 design, whoops. And Parker Bridwell. On the pack two. Now, for those who have opened this in the past, and taking a look at the back of their cards, they've noticed that there are different artists listed for each of these. Um, I think there's over 10 different uh, painters of this product. Like for example, this first card here, this was done by Dan Berggren. All right, so we have a Lewis Brinson from the Marlins, Ryan Healy, Jacob deGrom, Max Kepler, and Martin Maldonado. Moving on to pack three. First up, Filmara Vargas, Charlie Blackman. Who doesn't love that beard? Pretty epic. Alex Verdugo. Got a Reggie Jackson. Take a look at the back of this. Hall of Fame Gallery. I saw the odds of this on the box. I'll take a look at that again in a second. And Jack Flaherty round out the pack. So that Hall of Fame Gallery insert is one out of every 10 packs. So probably expecting one, of two, one or two per box. Thought the odds were a little higher on that, but I guess not. Adam Jones, Austin Hayes, Michael Taylor, K. 
Cam Gallagher. This is a private issue. And it's numbered to 250. Cam Gallagher again. And Paul DeJong rounding out the pack. Just checked on the odds on the private issue, the numbered parallels, and we're looking at one out of every 13 packs. So probably about, on average about one per box there. Got a Cam Gallagher rookie card. Another Walker Bueller. I have a growing Walker Bueller collection. Dylan Peters. Got a Jose Altuve masterpiece. Not numbered. And Jake Odorizzi. That masterpiece Altuve is going to be one out of every 10 packs as well. So again, expect one to two per box. Let's get another Altuve poking out here in the back. First up, Albert Pujols. John Smoltz. You got an Albies. Very nice. And Acuna. Let's take a look at this. The 52. So I don't know if there's anything else special about this, if it's a short print or what, but I'm happy that it is an Acuna. Beautiful looking card. Always love the 52 design. And lastly, that Altuve. I guess I was a little shocked at how many packs are in here, but it is an $80 box. I'm going to move these back. Still got plenty to go. So bear with me on this one. We haven't hit any of our autos yet. I do stop the camera in between every pack to not waste time. Paul Blackburn, Jackson Stevens, Buster Posey, Syndergaard, and Austin Meadows. I've lost count of what pack we're on. Just continuing on. No reason to count at this point. Dominic Smith. Didi, another Acuna, I think this is the base, Let's take a look at the back here, Jose Barrios, and <laughs> Bird, Bird the bust, and here are some of the artists, just want to go quickly back to this artist card. Uh, the woman on the lower left, uh, I believe her name is Mayumi Sato. I think she does the cards for um, the Topps Living Set. Somebody correct me in the comments if I'm wrong there, but I believe the name sounds familiar. Okay. Let's go here. Let's get an auto soon, right? Beautiful Soto. Not numbered. Trevor Story. Richard Urena. Ryan Sandberg. One of my favorite players growing up. And Nick Kingman. I do think Topps has a pretty nice set on their hands. Uh, really feeling the design of these. Uh, the quality of the cardstock in your hands is great. Hope this continues on in the future. We see maybe some 53 designs next year. First up, we got a chipper. Max Freed. Brandon Woodruff. And there's, oh ho ho! Jose Urena. Marlins. First auto. Take a closer look at that. Got a beautiful little autograph there. Very nice. And. Pedroia right behind him. Hello, Pedroia, meet your rookie card. All right, so first auto out of that pack. Wanted to get that auto all encased, so that's what I did. Got it on display out there. Miguel Gomez, rookie card. Clint Frazier, Yankees, rookie card. Beautiful Aaron Judge here. Looks like the base. Artist work is amazing. Oh, ho, ho. beautiful 52 trout here. Let's take a closer look at this one. 
I don't know if these are actual short prints or not, but ooh, do I love that card. Finally out of the pack, a Josh Donaldson. So pretty happy with the box so far. I think the only card I haven't pulled that I've wanted is an Otani. But we've got plenty of packs left here to go. Maybe we'll find one. Jose Albreu. Chris Taylor. Adam Duvall. Randy Johnson. And a Willie Adams rookie card. So got one auto to go. Whit Merrifield. Jesse Winker. Yasil. Okay, looks like this might be a special one here. Got a George Brett. Gold. It's a Hall of Fame gallery. Not numbered. Artist. This is Carlos Caballero. I don't know how special that one is, but I don't remember the other one having the gold on it. And there's another card I'd love to have pulled. J.D. Martinez. Besides Mookie, he is my favorite player on the Red Sox. Tim Locastro, rookie. Like Chris Bryant. Premio Reyes. Reyes, rather. I think we got a green parallel here of George Springer. Number to 99. 98 out of 99 for Mr. Springer. Very nice. Artist is Kevin Graham. Take a look at the front there again. Great parallel. And to round out the pack. Chad Green of the Yankees, who I've never heard of. Looks like we've got about six packs left to find our final autograph. Maybe another nice parallel in there. We'll see. Javier Baez, great card. Tyler O'Neill, rookie. Ichiro, future Hall of Famer. There is a Hall of Famer, another chipper in this box. Take a look at the back of this. Artist is Evan Showman. This is a masterpiece. And a Kershaw. Beautiful. So what does everybody think? Is that auto hiding in the final pack? Getting close to the end. Oh, don't want to hurt these corners, sorry. Taking so long. Got a Daniel Mengden. Look at that stash. <laughs> Carlos Correa. Aaron Arthur. Another 52 design. Gary Sanchez. And to round out the pack, Drew Smiley of the Cubs. Four packs left. Got a Don Mattingly, horizontal. Ryan McMahon, rookie card for the Rockies. Another Springer base. Daryl Strawberry, another one of my favorites growing up as a kid. And an Aaron Nola. Might just have to give that to my auntie, who's a huge Phillies fan, who bought me this box. Getting down to the end here, their final three packs. Lourdes Goriel Jr. Beautiful rookie card. Justin Verlander. Miguel Andujar. Beautiful. Here's our Shohei. All right, what's special about this one? This is an Impressionist. So, might be some kind of special parallel. Take a look at that. Mr. Jeff Molinson is the artist. 
And to round out the pack, there's a Harrison Bader, Cardinals. All right, so I think I pulled every single card that I've wanted to, at least a, one of each player that I wanted, and uh, couldn't be happier with this box unless there is some autograph monster hiding in one of these final two packs, like number to 25, Acuna would be amazing. Trey Mancini, AJ Minter, Ahmed Rosario. I took it off camera. I wanted to see if it was an auto. John Carlos Stanton. And a Conseco. We're going to go back to the Stanton here. It's got a green border. We are numbered to 250. 208 out of 250. Another throwback design on the 52s. All right, Tops, what did you hide for me in this final pack here? This is going to be it. We've got an auto. We have to. I'm be pretty upset if there's not one in here. All right. I think we've got it backwards. I'm going to hide it for the last card to show off. I still don't know who it is. Just got an Ozuna. Starling Marte, Sean Doolittle, Ian Kinsler, looks like it might be some kind of parallel, and I am going to pull this to the side, okay, looks like this should be our auto, Steven Souza, numbered to 99. Another by Carlos Caballero. There she is. So I don't know too much about this player. It is a green parallel, number to 99, Steven Souza Jr. for the Angels. Or, I'm sorry, yeah. Oh, sorry, Arizona Diamondbacks, my bad. 84 of 99. I'll have to do a little more research on him. If anybody knows anything about Mr. Souza, let me know in the comments. All right, so let's recap the pulls from this box. So the two best base cards that I have are the two Brave studs, Albies and Acuna. These were the masterpieces. Looks like they're one out of every 10 packs. Got two of those with the Chipper and Altuve. Now these were only one out of every five packs. These, uh, I guess they would call them Heritage, but I did get three of them. And they weren't junk. I mean, I have the Trout, the Acuna, and the Walker Bueller. So I don't think I could have done much better there. And we've got our three parallels. We got the Stanton to 250, the green. George Springer. This was to 99. And I think I missed this the first time around. This was a private issue. I didn't realize it was a parallel, and that's also numbered to 250 for Cam Gallagher. I may have gone over it, I may not have, I don't remember it. And I think the toughest pull from this box was this Impressionist card. So I was looking over the odds. This is one out of every 142 packs, and to get a, a, an Otani with odds like that is pretty phenomenal. So I was really impressed with this product overall. And then of course, the final two hits out there in front of you, the the autos of Urena and Souza Jr. So definitely two thumbs up to Topps Gallery 2018 product. Not a bust at all. I really enjoyed that rip. I think I got a lot of value out of it. I'm um, gonna do a little more research on my two autos out there, see kind of what they're worth on the market. But um, for now, I'll be keeping them. Probably even some slab candidates, uh, especially this Impressionist Otani that I pulled. Still can't get over this card, how nice it is. Love the hand-drawn artwork. I think that's why I'm drawn to 51 Bowman cards, how beautiful they are with the, the hand-drawn images. But uh, thanks so much for watching. Please uh, hit up one of my social medias, or both of them if you're on them. Uh, really appreciate the support and love. Thanks so much for watching. Do me a huge favor, hit that like and subscribe button. We're fast approaching 250 subscribers. And I think I'm gonna have a little contest uh, once we get there, so uh, continue. Uh, enjoying my videos, subscribing if you can, and we'll talk to you soon in the next video.